so, hi, <laughs> it's me, Don. How you doing? Hello, hey. I'm going to do my first ever unboxing video. Figured I'd get in on the unboxing game since I'm uh, back doing this plant thing again and uh, have to, well, I don't have to, but I want to rebuild my orchid collection and get, uh, get back into or get more into um, some uh, rare plants that you can't find at your local nursery. So, got a box here. It's a big one <laughs> um, from Equigenera. Uh, they're, they have a, a nursery down in Florida, but they ship a lot of plants up from Ecuador. I don't know if these plants came from Ecuador or if they were grown in their shop, in their nursery in Florida. Honestly, I don't care because I'm just excited about it. And I wanted to bring you along on the journey <laughs> as long as I can get this box open. The, uh, they did a good job on taping. We'll get that spot in a second. So I ordered a bunch of plants from Equigenera. I'm excited to see what, well, I know what I got, but I'm excited to see them and get them all potted up and, and, uh, all in their uh, in their new homes. So we got three plants here. They are all orchids, and don't mind the uh, sound of the Bigfoot. That would be Swagger, um, my mastiff. He decided to grab a toy and put it up on the sofa with him. So we got. Three orchids, and judging by the size of this box and how heavy this box was, they're all pretty decent size. So that is cool. The tag is taped to the outside. Cute. I like it. I like it. Now, if I can just get it all. So this is an Oncidium Hastolabium. I don't know if that'll come, where, where are we at? There we go. Yeah, it's probably backwards, so I'm just, yeah, it's not gonna do you any good. But uh, it's an Oncidium, so it should be a nice, oh God, from what I can feel, <laughs> the plant is up here. So yeah, this is gonna be a tall one. I'm excited about that. I'm hope, hoping that what I'm feeling is uh, a bloom spike. No, Swagger, no. It's not for you. Relax. Relax. Seems to be wrapped up pretty nice. It's a little moist, so that's good. Sorry for anybody that doesn't like that word. Um, but yeah, it's a little, little, little damp. How's that? A little damp for the journey. So we appreciate that. And just gonna cut down here, make sure I'm not getting any of the plant. Oh my goodness, look at this. Oh, <laughs> this is so nice. So nice. Okay, so, oh wow. All right, so everything that I was feeling was a leaf. <laughs> goodness. This is huge. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that. So it's Oncidium. And this looks, I'm assuming this is, if it's not blooming size, it's very close to it. Um, Actually, this this lead right here, this one right here did have a bloom spike, which is right there. So when it puts out new growth, this should have have an, another spike, another bloom spike. Oh, I'm excited to see that. Um, yeah, that's gorgeous. Love it. Wrapped in sphagnum moss. The roots are wrapped. 
sure the roots are nice and healthy. No, we don't want to do that. I don't want to do that here. Wow. Well, if that's, <laughs> if that's what we're to expect from this one, I can't wait to see the others. That's gorgeous. All right. So where are we at? So this one's a little shorter, <laughs> not as tall. Where's the label? There we go. All right, so this is Andantonia Amethyst Jim Lavender Lou. So if you know me, so Andantonia Amethyst Jim Lavender Lou. If you know me, you know I love purple, so I had to get this. The, uh, the picture of the flower, it's, it's uh, kind of purplish. <laughs> um, so I want to collect purple flowers. So that's why I got this baby. And it's, uh, the Andantonia is related to the Oncidium, like the, the one that I just got. So there are... They're cousins. Oh, beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Yeah, this is going to be cute. It's going to give me nice flowers. Oh, I can't wait to get this potted up. Hopefully, I have pots big enough. <laughs> I have to check now. I didn't expect the plant this big. But... Yeah, there's a lot of pseudobulbs on here. I don't know where the growth comes from. Oh, wait a minute. Hello. Hey, baby. We got new growth. There's new lead right there. New growth coming out of there. Oh, this is so fun. Oh, this is fantastic. I love it. I love it. This is great. Yes. All right, last but not least. So this one, I, I've never had, sorry if I'm not looking at the camera. I've never had any, uh, any of this, this type before. This is, um, where's the label, there it is. This is a, a Lilia, I guess that's how they pronounce it. Lilia or Lilia purpurata, and uh, variation atro purpur <laughs> All right, so Lilia purpurata, variation atro um, I don't know why I showed this to you because it's backwards. But this is, it's a uh, very nice, they're related to Cattleyas and very big flower. Um, they're typically white with uh, some type of purple lip or purple in the uh, the petals. If I remember correctly, this one has like a red reddish purple tint to the to the petals, um, which I just happen to love. I every picture I've seen, I've I've loved, and I, I've never seen. I never got a, a Lelia purpurata. Um, I don't know why I never had one, but I always wanted one. Oh, and, and Ecra Genera, I used to see them when I go to orchid shows, but since they're not, hi, here I am. Since they're not doing shows right now, they're doing a lot of online orders. So that is what these babies are. Right, so the roots are not wrapped in sphagnum moss. They're wrapped in paper. Looks like a beautiful plant. Got the root ball there. Doesn't look like any rotted roots. So they just need a drink and they'll be happy. Right plant, and actually, 
Oh, Equigenera. <laughs> I'm, I'm loving you. I don't know if this is ready to bloom or not. But there are, let's see if I can get this on the camera. There are two growths that the sheath here, there's one there. And where's the other one? There's the other one. One here. That's where the flowers will come out of. So I'm really hoping that once you get established and get settled, you'll push up some, some flowers. That's going to be awesome. As you can see, I'm in front of my, my uh, Ikea greenhouse cabinet. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll talk more about that later. <laughs> I, I, I don't want to give away any secrets yet, so we'll talk more about that later. But this is, oh, I'm in love with you. This is great. So if I can have two, ooh, don't hurt yourself. Two bloom spikes off of you, I'd be very happy. All right, so there's my plants, my Lelia purpurata, which is a, it's an orchid species, and this is a different variation of said species. I, uh, I'll probably get some more purpurata eventually. And then, can't pick that tag up. Come on, come on, there we go. And then the big guy, gosh, this is huge. We'd have to cut this this leaf off. It looks a little damaged. It's not going to hurt the plant at all, though. So the, whoops, Oncidium hastelabium, which I believe is a species. I'll have to look that up, but I'm pretty sure that's a species. And then. This pretty baby, the Oncidium Amethyst Gem Lou, or I'm sorry, Lavender Lou. Yes, Lavender Lou, <laughs> Lavender Lou. I think me and Lavender Lou are gonna be good friends. Yes, we are. All right, so that is my first unboxing. Thanks for watching. Um, yeah, and uh, stay tuned for more because there will be more and I'll, Try to do some more plant videos. I have the light off on my cabinet behind me because it was washing me out. You couldn't see me. That's not good. You don't want to see me. All of this, yes. So, but thank you for watching and um, stay tuned for more. All right. Bye. Love you.